So I've been animating a lot of routes and paths over the past two years for a variety of different clients. And I wanna share with you one of my favorite little techniques here that allows you to create a custom route quickly and easily. First off, let me show you inside of GeoLayers how to create a route. So let's say that a client wants us to animate a driving route from Paris to London. So the way I would do this is I would search Paris here and add that to the browser. And then I would search London and I would add this to the browser as well. And then you just grab both of them, you shift click and hold, and make sure if you're going from Paris, you want that one to be at the top and grab it first. And then right down here, you can select connect features, and it allows you to connect it by any of these methods that you would like. I said we're gonna be driving there, so I would select car, and that's gonna give us this new feature here, which is this path. And now we'll draw out this feature, so we have this route. But let's say our client said, no, 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 I wanna go from Paris, but I wanna go through Normandy here, and then I wanna to go to London in that direction. So there's a little city over here called Cherbourg. So what we could do is we could search that city as well. And it's right here. I'll go ahead and download this one. And now I can place this feature up here. And what I can do is grab all three of these and now select connect features. And if we select car, it's gonna draw another route again, but we have a problem. It's still sending us back through this same route. So even if we grab these two and we connect these features, you know, it's really not gonna do what we want it to do. So I wanna create a custom driving route through this direction. In these situations, I use a website called Google My Maps. Simply Google My Maps and you will find it. So this is what the interface looks like. I'm gonna click on Create New Map and this is a really cool tool that allows you to create your own routes and customize them. So I'm going to click on this button right here that says add directions and it's gonna add a new layer over here on the left. And now I can simply type out uh, Paris for my first location. And then for the second one, we'll type in London and now you'll see it quickly mapped it out. As I move the cursor over the route, check this out. It says drag to change route. So I can click this and start to move it over here to Cherbourg and then check that out. Now we have our new route. So I can type in here, Paris, Cherbourg, I think that's how you spell it, London. Another way that you can do this is you can actually, let's go ahead and add another directions layer. We'll do the same thing here, Paris. And this time let's type in the second one here. And you can click on add destination and that'll be a little bit more precise because if you're dragging to create a new route, it can send you, um, you know, down a street that you don't wanna go down or send you in like a, make you do figure eights or something like that. Now I have this new layer that I created that's nice and precise. I can go up here and click on this and select export to KML slash KMZ. And I don't wanna export the entire map, that would export all the layers. I just want this one, this last one that I created, Paris to London via Cherbourg. And you can export it as a KML instead of a KMZ. So KMZ is like the zipped version of a KML, I guess. Now I can come back over to GeoLayers 3 here, click on this little plus button, and then select import file. Go find the file here. And now if I double click on this to zoom into our map, I now have the new route and you can see we actually have these point items here for our feature as well. So it actually brought in all the locations as well as the route, which is very cool. So now I can just draw this out very quickly. So this is something I use all the time. I suggest you check it out, go play with it. I even use this sometimes to map out small sections of roads. So now we have our two paths. We have Paris to London via Calais and then Paris to London via Cherbourg. Big shout out to my tier three patrons, Tyson the Keymaster, Mike and Sandra over on YouTube at Flumi Plus One, Ryan, Josh, and He Who Seeks. Thank you all so much for making this video possible.